Hey everyone, this is Mike from theparkprodigy.com and on today's video we're going to break down exactly how you can purchase your Universal Orlando tickets from our website, The Park Prodigy. We know just how overwhelming planning a Orlando vacation can be and that's why we made it our goal to make sure you are saving time and money on your next trip and we make it our goal no matter if you're purchasing Orlando theme park tickets or if you're purchasing a vacation package we're rolling out the red carpet making sure you are as prepared as possible going into your days in the park in this video we are going to break down the benefits of purchasing from our company the park prodigy but also we're going to ask you some questions at home just to make sure no matter who you buy your theme park tickets from that you are getting the right fit ticket for your vacation so let's get started So before we jump into exactly how you could purchase your tickets from our website, let's jump into some of the benefits you will receive at home by buying from the Park Prodigy. Number one and the most important, we are a registered travel agency, which means you are getting registered and authentic theme park tickets. And same thing with vacation packages. Not only that, but we are universal experts and we will always give you our unbiased opinion on what is the best fit ticket for you, where you'll get the most value for the tickets you're buying. And really we wanna make sure you're getting the most out of your time in Orlando. Number two, and talking about getting the most out of your time, early park admission. All Park Prodigy clients that purchase their Universal theme park tickets will get early park admission into the park. And you guys can save up to three hours. It is a huge benefit and a great way to get so much more done in a short amount of time. Number three, daily park plans. We don't want to just send you into the park unprepared. We want to make sure you are as prepared as possible. And that's why we will sit down and help you come up with a custom itinerary for your days in Universal Orlando. Number four, something we have going on I'm very, very proud of, and that is the Magically Carbon Free Program. That allows us to offset the carbon emissions of your trip down to Universal Orlando at no additional cost to you. And last but not least, our Magic Rewards program because who doesn't love to save a little money when going on vacation? This program allows you to earn gift card points and the best part is we allow you to put those gift cards towards the purchase price of your tickets so that means less money out of your pocket. Those are just some of the benefits that you will get from the Park Prodigy but now let's jump in to the basics. I know just how important it is to start here and we want to make sure that you understand exactly how many parks there are and what your options are when purchasing your theme park tickets. So here at Universal Orlando we have three amazing theme parks. We have Universal Studios, Islands of Adventure, and Universal's Volcano Bay. Now they're all amazing in their own right but depending on what you guys want to see the most we might recommend a specific ticket. So that's why we just like to give a few basic information before we jump into the next set of questions. Okay, so now we're over at theparkprodigy.com on our Universal Orlando ticket page. What we wanted to do very quickly before we jumped into how you could purchase your tickets from us, The Park Prodigy, is go over your ticket options when visiting Universal Orlando. So what you'll see is there are four main options for visiting the parks. We have the two park, one park per day option, then we have the two park, park to park option. Now, the two parks included in this ticket are Universal Orlando and then Universal Islands of Adventure. Now, the other options we have are the three park, one park per day ticket, then also the three park, park to park ticket. So if you've been following and paying attention, you know that this ticket is going to include Universal Studios, Volcano Bay, and Islands of Adventure. Now. Obviously, there are some additional ticket options. You guys can always add express passes. Universal does have some special ticket events throughout the year, such as Halloween Horror Nights, but these are the main options when planning your days in the parks. In the next section of this video, we are gonna break down some of the questions that you should be asking yourself at home when trying to find the best fit ticket for your group. So now let's take a look at some of the most commonly asked questions to make sure that your group is getting the best fit ticket 
for your next Universal vacation. So the most popular and the most important question would really be which Universal Orlando theme parks do you want to visit? So when we're looking at the theme parks, you know you have to take a look at Universal Studios, Islands of Adventure, and then the water park, Volcano Bay. Now, just because it's a water park doesn't mean that Volcano Bay is not an all-day event. This park is marketed as the third turnstile the third park at universal orlando a little different from disney where you have the four main parks plus the two water parks but volcano bay in itself is an amazing day and really their third park and we 100 percent agree with them so you do have to kind of figure out what universal parks are you really looking to visit now some of the things that can help you try and decide that are the attractions which attractions are the most important to you which attractions are your must do's what do you have to do when you go to universal orlando are you into the thrill rides are you into the the water park rides or are you just visiting for the wizarding world of harry potter now that's a very common question we receive as well just to confirm, you do not need a separate ticket to access the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. The Wizarding World of Harry Potter is included with all Universal Orlando tickets. The only difference is that it is split into two themed lands. You have Diagon Alley and Hogsmeade. Now, in order to see both Universal Orlando Harry Potter worlds in the same day, you do need the Park to Park ticket. However, if you guys decide that you want to take your time, you can also go with the one park per day ticket and you can extend your trip or just plan your trip and stay multiple days. So those are some of the important questions we like to ask. Also, are you looking to see maybe some of the characters that they have at Universal? Some of the, the most popular ones are SpongeBob, Shrek, the Minions. Is that an important part of your trip? Because then you'll, you know, you'll kind of have to gear your days around that. Are you looking to go and get your own Harry Potter wand? So these are a lot of the things you have to consider and you want to really be prepared going into your days in the park. So we always recommend to get a feel for the rides, really pick your most important rides and that's why we love helping you guys come up with the park plans because when we we ask these questions and we get a feel what is the most important thing to you what do you have to do at universal orlando the other things to consider are also like we discussed that special event specifically halloween horror nights is do you have to go and visit halloween horror nights if so then you definitely have to visit during september and october when the event is going on the other thing is, are you looking to avoid the crowds? Are you looking to visit Universal for Christmas when they have the Christmas decorations up? So if you are, right, then it's going to be simple. You very simply, you'll be able to pick how many days you're going to spend in the park, which parks you want to see, one park per day, park to park option, and then you just pick your dates. But if you are maybe looking to visit during the cheapest time to visit Universal Orlando, then you have to take a look at some of our free tools, such as our Orlando crowd calendar. And we'll help you kind of pick the time of year when the parks are a little bit less crowded. And what happens is when the parks are less crowded, ticket prices tend to come down a little bit. So you'll really be purchasing the cheapest ticket options. Outside of that, those are really the most important things to ask. In the next section of this video, we're going to show you very simply how you use our online store and how you could purchase your tickets using our website. So now we're going to show you exactly how you can purchase your ticket from our website, theparkprodigy.com. So I'm going to go down the list with you at home. I'm going to show you which questions we need to get answered to get the right fit ticket for your group. So first question is, we're going to select the numbers of days you plan to spend in Universal. I personally love to spend as much time as possible, so I'm going to go with five days right here. The next question is going to be, just like we've been discussing, which parks will you visit? Now you have two choices, like we said, Universal Studios, Islands of Adventure, or the three park ticket, which is Universal Studios, Volcano Bay, and Islands of Adventure. So I'm going to go with the three park ticket then you can do one park per day or park the park i love to go park the park i'm going to go with that option right here then i have one adult and then we're going to come down here i already kind of selected already i love going during the holidays so we're going to go with november 13th as our start date now that start date is important because the tickets actually fluctuate based on the start date so you'll want to make sure that you know exactly when you plan to visit the parks so Right here, we kind of outline exactly which tickets you're looking to get. We have the five-day. We got one adult park-to-park -park ticket. 
we have our total price of the ticket here. But then what we do here on the right is we actually are going to apply those magic rewards points that we spoke about. We're going to apply that against the total of your ticket price. So as you can see here on the left, this would be the price if you went and just purchased from our website without the magic rewards points. However, given your $16 discount, this is your new subtotal right here. Then, just like you would using any other online store, when you're ready to proceed, you're going to add your tickets to your cart. So now we're gonna come here to the cart. Now, we're running a promotion right now for first time guests where you'll get a extra $10 off. So I have that coupon code. If you at home are looking for that coupon code, be sure to just reach out, email me at mike at theparkprodigy.com. I'll send you a coupon code to use during checkout. So I have the coupon code here, entered it. We're going to apply that coupon. And then we can see here, coupon got applied. And once again, on the cart, you can very simply just see the exact type of ticket that you are going to be purchasing from us at the Park Prodigy, also that start date. So once you are ready, proceed to checkout and here we are. So again, very similar to any of the other online stores that you've used in the past, you're gonna enter your information here. You're gonna enter your billing information for the credit card you're going to use. Here at the Park Prodigy, we use a company called WooCommerce for our credit card processing. Now we use them, they're one of the most popular e-commerce shops out there. We use them for security purposes. We are super, super passionate about making sure that you guys are secure as you're purchasing from our site. We also have the trusted site logo down there on the bottom. And then we also are GoDaddy security verified. So there's a couple different steps just to make sure that the website is secure, but very simply, you would enter your credit card info and then come down here, place the order. The other cool thing is your credit card's not gonna be charged right away. And all of our ticket orders are typically processed within 24 hours. Call us up, we could definitely do it sooner for you guys, but most likely it's gonna be 24 hours. You will 100% receive an email as soon as you place this order, just letting you know, hey, we did get your ticket order, 100% working on it. And in the meantime, if you do have any additional questions, you can always reach out to us that way. The other cool thing about our tickets, because we are a travel agency, is they are the exact same Universal Orlando tickets that you would receive if you purchase from Universal Orlando, plus all the additional benefits we discussed, such as that early park admission. So those are just some cool things. So if for any reason, let's say you have to move your trip, right? It is the same cancellation policy. Unfortunately, the Universal will not refund your tickets. However, you can always change the date of your tickets and upgrade your tickets to use them in the future. So you won't really lose the cost of the ticket. And that's pretty much it, guys. We have a, a couple more videos going through the process, specifically picking your tickets up and the early park admission coming very, very soon. But that is the process to purchase from the Park Prodigy. Okay, and there you have it. That is how you purchase your Universal Orlando tickets from us, the Park Prodigy. Thank you guys so much for checking out this video. I just want you to know at home, if you do still have some additional questions, we would love to hear from you and we would love to help you. You can always reach us on our website via chat. You could send us an email. You can call us at the office, whatever works best for you. And you wanna know what? Doesn't matter who you speak with at the Park Prodigy, any of our agents are super helpful and would love to help you. You can always email me, mike at theparkprodigy.com and I would love to help you out. But that's all the time we have for today. Thank you guys again so much and hopefully I'll talk to you soon.